Good morning. Good morning. So we are continuing with um, my theme of sharing some behind the scenes of a small business owner, at least what my small business processes look like and some of my thoughts. Um, Cause it's what, you know, people, people ask and I, I believe it is very smart to ask to gain uh, knowledge and different perspectives of that nature. A um, couple of things going on in the car today, which is my mobile office. This is my mobile office. We've got my we got my theme music playing. You know, I had I commissioned my brother to create theme music for me. It's just easier to have your own music versus trying to use somebody else and make sure that you get all the copyright permissions and all that kind of stuff. Um, furthermore, it speaks to me. And I also want to have a consistent sound. So I don't use a lot of different background music. I'm using typically the same ones because, well, it's, it's mine. But also in this mobile office, we've got my mobile Wi-Fi. Got my Wi-Fi here, a little 5G Wi-Fi. And, and yeah, I could use the phone as a hotspot, but I don't like using the phone as a hotspot because I'm doing that for other stuff. Like, I'm, I am multitasking. We also have my Microsoft Surface laptop here because we are working it. We are working it. Now, people are like, oh my God, you're not using? Let me tell you, when I do these um, virtual conferences and, and webinars and stuff, and I use my 4K camera on this laptop, people are like, what are you using? I'm like, dude, it's just my laptop. But you know, people want to sleep on brands. I'm not that brand loyal. I'm about getting the most bang for my buck. I will invest in, in all things, but I don't, I'm not like attached to a brand in that manner. There's a couple of things, knives, cookware, um, pens, you know, I, I may have some brand loyalty there, some housewares, but other than that, okay, sneakers, but other than that, yeah. So we are getting ourselves together. We also have our calendar here. Like we, we review the calendar um, at least twice a week, typically on, on Monday, and then we do it again, like around Wednesday to make sure that we're all in a good place because you know, as you're, as you're going through the day, um, you know, there are consultations that are still coming in and obviously that changes your calendar. So we are always looking at the calendar to see what needs to be updated and, um, and make changes accordingly, accordingly. So yesterday I was, you know, speaking about authenticity and really knowing who you are. And I am a small business cheerleader. I know you all. Well, maybe you guys don't know. Maybe you don't. I know on my um, private Instagram I mentioned, because I, I love these glasses. I've worn these, clearly I wear them often. Um, but this is from Glitz Optical. And you know, when you find a small business that just really aligns with your values as a person in a small business, you cannot help but, you know, really shout them out and promote them without any, without any fee. You know, when you believe in something and somebody and their message, it just kind of comes with. Now, I am returning to the eyeglasses world, eyewear, because um, I had a custom pair made when I graduated um, in 2002. I have one picture of myself in those glasses, one, because on June 29, 2002, I had a car accident and those custom glasses were destroyed. And from that point on, I started to wear contact lenses because I was like, I will never, ever spend that kind of money on glasses ever again, ever. You know how they say you should never say never, right? Okay, yeah, so I have bought, I don't know how many pair of glasses from Glitz Optical at this point, but they are gorgeous and I love them. And these have blue light filter. You can kind of see them when I move certain ways, that little hints of rainbow. So these have the blue light filter and their transition lens. So we're back. We're back in the game. And you know, I'm gonna blame a few people for it. I think Oprah was one of them. I love her eyeglass collection, love it. I don't know if she sells anything, maybe I'm missing it. I haven't even researched, so clearly I'm not really like trying to buy anything else. But um, I could have sworn there was a time too where people were wearing glasses that didn't have any lens in them, or they were just wearing glasses without a prescription because it made them look, I don't know, intelligent or something. And people think people with glasses are highly intelligent or smart. And those are two different things, by the way. They're not the same thing. The good thing is Gwendolyn is both smart and highly intelligent. So glasses and none. I got it. So this is how we start the day. If it's me not commuting, then um, we start this after our row. We get a good workout in. 
And yes, you need to work out to keep yourself mentally fit and emotionally fit and physically fit, all that matters. But we get ourselves together and then from there, the day begins. So <sighs> it's the job, people, it's the job. And I wanna say, I've said this before, I don't believe in just quitting your job and going for the gusto, that's not my thing. I did it, it didn't work out for me. So to each his own. But I believe you could also take your full-time gig and really learn what business practices you want to adopt into your own business. And then also too, this helps fund your small business until it is doing what it needs to do. So who doesn't like a little extra help? Is it work? Yes. But who doesn't like a little extra help? 